Listen, here, when Alexis is gone, we just start straight with the desserts for Taste Take. I won't even mess around. We got bombshell bakes in the house. Brandy Neal, one of my new dearest friends. Because <laughs> look at this. This is fantastic. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Where are you guys located right now? We're located in Evansville, Indiana, okay. but we do ship. Okay. Yes, we so do So that's ship. nice, mm -hmm. especially with summer coming up. Sometimes you don't want to mess with, like, Fourth of July picnics and yes. having to make stuff. They just order it from you. Just order it, ship straight to your door. How did you start Bombshell? How did that come to be? Great question. So a friend of mine back in college ordered a cake for me um, probably around 2018, and I dropped it off to him in a barber shop. And the owner of the barber shop was like, do you do this for a business? Like, do you bake for other people? I'm like, I do now. <laughs> so from there, I kind of just started building Bombshell, um, getting in the kitchen, experimenting. My recipes are 90% my own because I like to get in the kitchen and experiment. And so I just built it from the ground up like that. What's that like? Because I know that you probably have to have a certain love for your, I mean, if it's your yes. own recipe, that, that has to make it feel even more special. Yes, definitely. Um, that's one of my bragging points when they say what sets you apart. Yeah. Like, I'm not a Pinterest baker or, you know, a Facebook recipe baker. I like to get in the kitchen and experiment myself, so. It's also fair to say that you're a champion baker, right? I because mean, I mean, yeah. you're a winner, right? <laughs> Explain, you, you just won a, a baking show. I did. A baking contest. Yes. What was that process like for you? How did you decide, like, yeah, I can put my stuff up against some of these people? Well, that was an interesting process. So, actually, my sister-in-law contacted me and asked would I be her assistant baker on the show. And I'm like, what? Me? Little old me? What do I know about being in the kitchen? And so, <laughs> she's like, just send in your pictures. Let's fill out the application. We had got this. And so, we did. We went through all the interviewing processes. Um, we had to bake, like, a display for them as well to even get on the show and so once we got on the show we shot the show in September I believe and then it aired in November so it was fun I was in my element it was yeah, so much fun everybody's like are you nervous I'm like no should I be and it was just yeah I can it's an experience I cannot explain but I would definitely do it again that's amazing congratulations on that Thank I you. do want to point out your shirt because it is absolutely adorable <laughs> it says you. obsessive cookie disorder yes which I think you qualify for, right? I like, do, I do. It, Although I, I always tell people I don't um, eat my own sweets. So, I mean, I, you know, I taste it. I mean, you it. have to, right? I taste little, it, yeah. but other than that, it's not like I'm baking it in the middle of the night for myself. <laughs> no, I would if I had your talent. <laughs> the cookies on that shirt match the cookies on the plate. What do we yes. have here? Let's walk through some of this. Okay, so today we have cookies and cream, which is a top seller of mine. Yeah, I bet. Um, <laughs> and we also have turtle cheesecake, which cheesecake was the first item that I sold under Bombshell. And really? so I always say, you know, cheesecake, cheesecake, I'll put it up against anybody's. And then my cookies, they'll speak for themselves when you taste it. All right, which, all right where am I start? What should I start with? What do you think? Um, I'm going to leave it to dealer's um, choice. I want you to try a cookie first. All right. Yeah, I'm going to try a cookie first. <laughs> all right, let me get this open here. And you so, know, since COVID, individually wrap them, you know, so you can share with other people. That you does have to make it nice. Your box. Oh my yeah. gosh, that's so soft. <laughs> Brandy. <laughs> Get out of here. That is fantastic. Thank you. Yep, think on it. I can't. Mm -hmm. That's so good. <laughs> All right, we have 30 seconds. I'm going to go ahead and, oh my gosh. Grab I don't want to stop eating a cookie, but. All right, here we go. You have a soft Ooh, spot for cheesecake I do. with it being your first. I do. I love cheesecake. I'll take cheesecake over cookies any day. <laughs> I'm moving to Evansville. <laughs> I ship you, cheesecake and cookies. You don't even have to move. Just have them shipped right to, yeah, ship but, right to your door. See, you mentioned cooking your own stuff late at night. I'm going to come live with you and your husband. Ah, uh, gotcha. And then I'll just knock on the door and be like, hey, Brandy, you got any cookies made? <laughs> You know, that, these are these are fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thanks for coming and hanging out with us. QR code there on the screen is going to give you all the info, info so that you can get these bad boys shipped to you. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. Such a pleasure. Thank you. I'm going to eat all these during the break. <laughs>